everyone welcome back to my channel I know it's been a very long time since I've been on here but I thought I would try and do another video of this new game called Wild Shade it is on the Apple Store as of two days ago and I've been loving it this is the horse I've been currently using so far and this is the stable which has my other horses they are so adorable I love them you can breed them or as you're leveling, leveling them up you can actually obtain new horses by leveling up so yeah the coats are really nice and pretty but obviously I've been using this one for now uh, you can also customize saddles, bridles, blankets, hairstyles, hair dye and the rider by getting new saddles and other things you have to level up by doing more races etc and this is the breeding as well so normally every couple of hours the horses do change and you can breed them to get new coats, markings, eye colours, everything like that. This is the shop which you can currently only get moon coins and sun crystals at the moment. So this is the leaderboard here. Um, the profile friends hasn't been on here yet so it is coming soon. Uh, this is the tournament section and the racetrack sections. They normally change every three days, I believe. Um, so you have three maps and three maps on the racetracks and tournaments, and they just change in three days. So here we're going into a race here. Uh, this is Blossom Alley. This has actually been one of my favourite maps to go on. So I've been loving it so far. So here we go, just running, running, <laughs> galloping away. Um, it is kind of like Elysium Online, so if you have played that, it's kind of similar. Um, I do love Elysium Online, but I don't have a PC anymore, so I cannot play it. Uh, so normally you just race and you get percentage at the side, as you can see. Um, that's when it gets to 100 you get a like a power up kind of thing and you can use it to attack other horses well, <laughs> sounds awful doesn't it attacking but this is what you use to get them and obviously they'll either fall or do like a little animation where um, they'll either trip or something like that or d like that for example and then your horse becomes slower and everybody can go in front of you just like that. Um, it has been really fun, I have enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, I'll let you have a little watch of this. And as you come to the end of the race, you'll have like a little animation like this and then it'll go to the scores. 
and it'll total up all your scores and then you'll be ranked within the tournament. Uh, so I got a new record here which I'm quite happy about. And then the loading screen and then we're back here and then here um, it'll start leveling your horse up like this. And then that's what helps you get to level up on your own at the top there. So you can see I'm level 18. Um, so we'll go on another race here. So I think we went to the Ocean View one. This is another one of my favourite maps. I really enjoy this one. So as before, it's the same. There isn't any of like racing things like jumping races or country races or whatever. Um, it's just like this, like kind of like a magic one, you know, on LC Online. It's really similar, as I've said before. Um, them grass things, them grass wind tornado things are the worst ones. I hate them so much. They're really annoying. Um, but all the other power-ups I love. Um, especially the ice one, I always love the ice ones. So you always get them as soon as they're behind you. And as you can see um, in the is it top right corner, it'll tell you what power up you've used if you did attack a horse and it'll give you some points as well. And that's normally used as well at the end to get all your scores. I know it is kind of a bit repetitive, um, but as I said, I do enjoy this very much. It's rare that I do enjoy horse games, especially on mobile, because I just think they're all like the same and all the graphics are bad quality and things like that, but this is really amazing. And I have been following them on their Facebook page since they was actually um, making this game. So I've seen, you know, them making obviously the horse models and everything and I'm so excited I was quite upset that I didn't get to be one of the beta testers for it um, but I think it was only like a week out I think or maybe more I don't know before it actually came out um, but yeah I would totally rec recommend this game if you love horse games it's so much fun and it's so good uh, I'm just cannot wait till I can start adding you guys or adding any more people on here. I don't know if we'll be able to race against each other or anything. Um, I'm really not quite sure but I hope that comes into that because I think it was so much fun racing against other people, especially friends that you've made and compare horses and everything like that. I just hope that I can get a rare coat because I know there's so many rare coats that you can get. Um, but yeah, so I hope you have enjoyed this video. I'll just let it go on for the rest of the video like this because I don't want to keep on chatting away. Um, so yeah, bye guys.